That's what I wanted to ask is, yeah. your, like, what are your thoughts on TikTok? It's, it's tough because you can have a really talented artist and they don't, they're not having a moment on TikTok. Therefore, they're not getting the same recognition as a crappy artist would with something going on TikTok. And, you know, for me, even as the record label, I'm guilty of it myself because I want to, I find myself choosing songs to release that I think could go viral on TikTok. And I think that takes away from the, the real art and, and, and talent of the musician. But at the same time, it's, you know, you can have it. What's, what do you want to do? Do you want to have an amazing song that nobody hears? Or do you want to have a song that everybody hears because it fits TikTok? And, you know, this is in the early stages. If you get to a point where you're a big enough artist and you have a big enough fan base, you don't need to put out TikTok songs. But I think in the beginning, it's the most valuable tool. And I'll also say that artists that know how to market their own music on their own channel, those are the ones that win. Yeah. Because most don't. A lot of artists are divas or they feel like they don't need to, you know, be on TikTok or it's corny. Those ones have a lot harder of a time succeeding than the ones that are just embrace it or that just embrace it and just say, I'm going to come up with a viral strategy and, you know, post and make it cool in my own way. 